Hi everyone! Today I'm going to be doing an unboxing and review of this Smart Video Doorbell. So this doorbell is 100% wire free, as you can see right up at the top. That means that it's really easy to install. Um, you don't have to hardwire it to your house. You don't have to plug it in. It works completely on a rechargeable battery. It also has ultra low power consumption, so that battery charge should last you a really long time. Um, it does have 180 pixels. Um, so it has a really clear picture, also has night vision, so you can see everything at night just as clear as if it was in the day. It has a um, local SD card, and you can record everything on that SD card, or you can also sign up to have the cloud recording. Um, you can share videos with this uh, doorbell. You can also have two-way audio, so you can talk to people from inside your house or through the app on the phone, and you can talk to them if they're at your door. Um, the app does work with iOS and Android, so it is uh, very user-friendly. And I'm going to go ahead and open it up and take a look at what's inside. So that top part just slid off, and then there's just a nice basic white box. So I open it up, and the first thing on top is the quick start guide. So that's going to help you um, just set up your doorbell really quickly. And again, since there's no hardwiring or anything, I'm guessing that it's going to take um, not that long to get everything set up. So this just shows what's inside the box. So there's the doorbell, USB cable, the user guide, which we have, the indoor chime. So that's really convenient because the doorbell can actually be used as a doorbell. So you can have the chime on the inside of your house. So if somebody rings the doorbell, you'll probably get an alert on your phone on the app as well as hear the actual chime. It has the screws and tools that you need to set up the doorbell and it has a SD card that it comes with. So that's really convenient. If you don't wanna use the card, you can use your local storage right there. Um, things you might need that aren't included if you need to adjust the doorbell angle um, and also the cloud service. So here's some QR codes right there. Just a little bit more information about the rechargeable doorbell and how to install the batteries, which we're going to do as well. How to run a test, um, live viewing, playback, all the information that you need right there. So it looks like everything is pretty straightforward. Um, how to share your device, how to connect with the doorbell chime, everything you need is right here and I also like this manual looks really easy to follow and um, nice color picture some troubleshooting there as well and um, looks like pretty simple next thing is a warranty card customer service lifetime technical support 12 month limited warranty and here is the doorbell itself so here is the um, ringer chime that you can plug into your house so that you can hear the doorbell looks like it charges with a USB well, pop that out. Put that aside. And next thing in the box, I think this is the tools. Yep, looks like tools to connect the doorbell and everything you need. Open this up. So inside we have the USB charging cable right here to charge it. There's uh, two different types of screwdrivers. Um, there is the tools that help you um, open the doorbell up so that it can't be stolen if you need to recharge your battery. And everything is right there. Next, we'll take a look at the doorbell itself. Right, and that, I think, is everything that was in the box. Yep. Right, so here's the wireless doorbell. Um, it comes with a plastic coating on it so that it's completely scratch free. You can tell that it's brand new. Um, and this is the housing. So if you were to install this, you would mount this right to um, your house with the screws that it came with. Uh, doorbell says remove before use. I'm gonna try to pop that out. There you go. The doorbell just comes right off. So this part would be easy to install. Remove this before use. And that's the batteries inside. So I'll go ahead and open it up and take out the batteries. And this is just, um, again, to protect your doorbell. There's a little tool to open that up as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and charge it. Oh, here's the bottom charging port. So if you need to charge your um, doorbell, it's a simple regular charger, which it came with as well. You will need a block to charge it, but most of us have those at home. So I'm gonna go ahead and unscrew this and then check out the batteries and give the doorbell a try. And there's the batteries right inside. So those are rechargeable batteries. Still a piece of plastic was just protecting it so that the batteries weren't getting used up while 
here. I'm just heard it turn on. So it looks sounds like it's working great. I'll just screw these back on. And then I'm going to go ahead and set up the app on my phone and then test out the doorbell. Okay, there we go. So the smart video doorbell was really easy to install. I did charge the battery for a while as they recommended that in the manual you charge for um, a few hours just to get the battery at full capacity. Uh, it was The app was really easy to set up, about took five minutes maybe to connect the doorbell, to connect it to the Wi-Fi and use the QR codes to get it set up. Um, I put it right outside our door and as I just showed you a little video of um, just how the doorbell worked and how it picked up cars going by, it picked up um, you walking to the car and it was really easy to record that video. I could share it as well right through the app and it was um, pretty simple. So it seems like a really great doorbell. I love that it's wire free. It's easy to connect. You don't have to install anything. Um, the doorbell feature is really nice to have in your house so that somebody can actually ring your doorbell. And the app was really user friendly. So I hope you guys found this unboxing and review helpful and that you give the smart doorbell a try. Thanks.